Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Peyton Forbes. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, April 22nd, 2021. Let's go to Annalisa to see what's happened today in history. Thank you, Peyton. Today in history on April 22nd, 1760, roller skates made their first recorded appearance at a party in Carlisle House, London. A young musician named John Joseph Merlin rode into a London party while playing the violin and wearing these very first roller skates. It was not a successful introduction as the violinist crashed into a mirror, causing nearly $1,000 worth of damage, including destroying his violin. I guess in this case, the show did not go on. Now let's go to Chris for the sports highlight. Thank you, Annalicia. Today's sports highlights are presented to you by the Patriots. Flyboarding is now a new extreme sport. Just when you think extreme sports cannot get any crazier or more exciting, along comes another one. This one, however, does not involve falling from extreme heights or flying around in special suits, but allows the athlete to frolic and perform crazy stunts in the water. Welcome to flyboarding. To get going, the user simply straps on the jet boots and attaches the other end of the hose to the motor of a powerful jet ski. As the jet ski starts up, the robust stream of water it creates is channeled into the long hose, which in turn propels the human at the other end high up into the sky and allows him or her to perform a variety of maneuvers like flips and spins. Now let's go to Noah to see what's for lunch. Thank you, Chris. Today's lunch is here sandwich, Italian course salad, mixed fruit, mayo, and milk. Bon appetit! Now let's go back to Peyton. Thank you, Noah. Patriots, the yearbook is currently on sale. Remind your parents to get you your yearbook today before they sell out. All yearbook purchases must be made through myschoolbucks.com. Scholars, this month we'll show that we are FSA ready. Here are the upcoming April FSA dates. Every day we will have an activity that is FSA related. Today you can create a newspaper advertisement about testing. At the end, your class could put them together on a piece of paper to make a giant newspaper all about testing. You can share your pictures on OneDrive. Hey, Patriots! Let's check out some of our very own scholars showing that they are FSA ready. Let's watch this awesome rap video by Chanel. Show it. Your work. But make sure to eat first. FSA, a has been. You gonna pass it. Focus. Listen. Bruh, you got this. FSA, a has been. You gonna pass it. Show it. Yo work. But make sure to eat first. FSA, a has been. You gonna pass it. Focus. Listen. Bruh, you got this. FSA, a has been. You gonna pass it. And here's Miss Barrow's class with some fun tips on how to get ready for the FSA in their very own commercial. Dude, this FSA is so hard. No, all you gotta do is call 911 Barrow's. They'll give you all the information you need. Oh, yeah, you're right. Let me call them. Oh, uh, Miss Barrow's, I need help calling them. Okay, Destiny, I've got you. Okay, I have a student here who needs some tips. 911 Barrows, how can I help you? Is this 911 um, Barrows? I need help. Stat. I can't pass my FSA. Well, I've got you. I've got tips for you. Did, did you just say Q-tips? Oh, FSA tips. Okay. Well, first of all, you should study your notes. That'll really make a difference. Second of all, you need to pace yourself because you can't be too fast and you can't be too slow. And third of all, you need to have a good night's rest. Well, what about my breakfast? Oh, yeah. A good breakfast. Do you have any ideas? 
What about my <clears throat> Reese's Puff? Reese's Puff. Eat them up, eat them up, eat them up, eat them up. Can I have those? Sure. Lastly, do your best. Wow, thank you for all the great tips. I'll definitely pass. Have a good day. Now let's see what the weather is going to be like today with David. Thank you, Peyton. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 83 degrees Fahrenheit and scattered thunderstorms. I love the rain. It's my favorite weather. Now let's go to Samuel for the joke of the day. Thank you, David. And here's today's joke of the day. What did the letter say to the stamp? Stay with me and you'll go places. Now let's go to Sonia for today's birthday. Thanks, Samuel. That was super funny. Today's birthday girls are Amelia Long and Sienna Sanchez. Happy birthday. Let's go back to Peyton. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Newton, Miss Dry, Miss Vero, Miss Kane, Miss Yearwood, Miss Julian, and Mr. Bonilla. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was I come from a mine and always get surrounded by wood. Everyone uses me. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was pencil lead. Now for today's riddle. It belongs to you, but other people use it more than you do. What is it? Again, it belongs to you, but other people use it more than you do. What is it? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. When will we announce on the following day? Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a thankful Thursday. And don't forget, remember, we unite, rise. Have a great day.